What's happening, everybody? Steve here from the Whiskey Hideaway, and today is uh, cocktail number seven of 50, and this one is the Mint Julep. So today, we are going to be using the 2XO, so the very first thing that we need to do here is we need 10 mint leaves and put them in here, and uh, let's see here. I've got my nice little mint plant that I picked up from the grocery store. And I am going to, what I don't use in this, I'm going to transplant this because mint grows like gangbusters. And so I'm just going to keep this going. I'm going to put it in a couple different pots and keep the mint going so that I can have mint juleps anytime I want. So let's see, we need 10 mint leaves. I'm 10. All right. So we're just going to throw these in here, right? So it says, press the mint leaves around the inside of the cup. All right, so I've got a nice little muddler here. So we're going to press these around inside the cup. And yes, this is a plastic cup. I try out here in the hideaway, the only glass that comes out here are these bottles. So I try not to bring any other glasses out here. I don't want anything to get, you know, broken and people step on something. All right, so now we need the liquids. So we need two ounces. Now in this one, it, call, it calls for Woodford, Woodford Reserve. Now I did pick up a bottle of Woodford Reserve, which I will be reviewing in another video. So stay tuned for our Woodford Reserve double oaked. All right, so let's get two ounces of our burn. We also need a half ounce of Demerara syrup. Now, you can't just go to the grocery store and get this stuff. Um, you may be able to order it on Amazon, but what I did was I got some Demerara sugar and I actually made the syrup according to the directions in this book. So now I've got some good syrup here. And this is stuff right here. You can make this, put it in a little bottle like this that I got at uh, Walmart and uh, just put this in your refrigerator and it keeps up to uh, three weeks. So uh, pretty simple. Beautiful. Now, we're going to throw some ice in here and stir this bad boy up. Okay. And we'll get a couple more here just for garnish. And there is our mint julep. And I can see why they normally put it in uh, a julep glass where you can't actually see the liquid because it basically looks like I'm drinking pond water, <laughs> but let's see how it tastes, right? Oh, mm. Gotta say, one of my all-time favorite cocktails, mint julep, A number one. Oh man, just so good. Mm. Mm. Oh, and it's a hot day today. So guys, thanks for watching this video and uh, we'll see you in the next one.